Hello everyone, it's Kendra here, Miss Kincaid. Thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. So if you did watch my last video, then you already know that I was doing a comparison video comparing two products. Now in this situation, it's going to be the Lotta Body Mousse versus the Shea Moisture Mousse because you guys always ask me, oh my goodness, which one is the best? Which one should I buy? And I'm like, I don't know, I like them both. So hopefully this video will shed some insight for all of us. So if you're interested in seeing this, then definitely stay tuned. As I said before you guys in my previous video I showed you guys how to blow out your hair I'll link that below so that you can see but I felt like starting off on blown out hair will give um, a better look at how the products work I felt like if I would have done this on my natural texture that it could have hidden some of the results and I definitely wanted to show you guys the type of definition that these products were able to achieve so that is why I decided to blow out my hair and the two mousses that I'm going to be comparing is the Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Frizz Free Curling Mousse with Silk Protein and Neem Oil to the Lotta Body with Coconut and Shea Oils Wrap Me Foamy Mousse. So let me tell you guys what these products claim to do. So the Shea Moisture product claims that it's anti-frizz, it claims to moisturize and add shine to your hair, while the Lotta Body Mousse claims to create soft wraps, define curls, and tame that frizz. For a little price breakdown, I purchased the Shea Moisture from Walgreens for $10.99. It has 7.5 fluid ounces in it, and I purchased the Lotta Body at Sally's Beauty Supply for $4.79, and it has 7 fluid ounces of product in it. So, honey, that is a big price difference, okay? So I just wanted to let you guys know that. All right, you guys, let's get started. So I'm gonna start by just parting my hair right down the middle, okay? I'm gonna use one product on one side and the other product on the other side. So I'm just gonna pin one side back so that I can work on the other side. So I'm gonna start with the Shea Moisture product on my left side, okay? And I'm just gonna apply two pumps of this product, okay? As you can see here, I applied one pump, but then I went back and figured out that that was not enough. So I'm gonna be adding some more, maybe even three pumps, I'm not sure. So I'm just going to add some of the product, and you guys know how I like to do it. I add it halfway on my hair, towards the end of my hair. I want a stretched look, so we're just gonna, oh, there's the third pump. <laughs> I want a stretched out, elongated look, so I just apply the product halfway on my hair so then I'm just gonna do a two-strand twist and that's pretty much it so I'm gonna continue on this section using the Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Frizz Free Curl Mousse and while I'm doing that I'm going to share with you guys some of the things that I'm experiencing with this mousse so first off it's very thin which is why I had to add like three or four pumps on some sections it's a very thin mousse so I guess when you squirt it out of the bottle it's it's foamy but it's not a lot of product so yeah so it, it feels very thin so I'm having to add um, a lot more remember this is the one with 0.5 more fluid ounces so mm, take that into account and it is the most expensive one at ten dollars and ninety nine cents so yeah, so reading the back of this uh, mousse, it says it has no sulfates, no parabens, no paraffins, no mineral oils, no synthetic fragrance, no synthetic color, no animal testing, and no DEA. So it says that it has coconut to hydro oh, coconut oil to hydrate and protect your hair while reducing breakage. It has silk protein to smooth your hair for a soft, silky feel. And then it also has neem oil to control the frizz while adding adding brilliant shine. All right, you guys, so now I'm gonna do the right side of my head with the Lotta Body with Coconut and Shea Oils Wrap Me Foaming Mousse. So right away, I squirted two pumps of this product onto my hair, and look, there is so much product on my hands left over, I added way too much. So it's safe to say that you only need one pump of this product. Um, so let me explain how this product feels. It is, it feels like a thicker mousse, which is probably why you only need one pump of the product. It feels very thick. Well, not very thick, but it feels 
way thicker than the Shea Moisture. And as you can see, there's still, um, you can still see the mousse left over on the hair. So it is a thicker product. So yeah, all I'm doing is adding one pump of this product. And remember, this is the product with seven fluid ounces and it retails for $4.79. So reading the back of this bottle, it says that um, it defines your curls and gives hold to twist outs, moisturizes dry, brittle hair, adds body and shine and long lasting control, no flaking which I absolutely love. So it says that coconut and shea oils deeply hydrate the hair. So it has both in here. This is a fast drying foaming mousse um, that leaves wraps soft, wraps soft and full of body. And it can be used for a wash and wear style. So I'd be interested in trying this on a wash and go just because of how thick this product is. Um, so it's supposed to leave your hair with defining curls and tame the frizz. So yeah, um, it doesn't say anything about it being free of parabens or sulfates or paraffins or DEA or anything like that. It does not say anything like that on the bottle. So I've added all of my twists and now I'm just gonna go sit under the dryer for about 15 minutes and then I will come right back with the results. So of course you guys know everything first. So I am comparing the Lotta Body um, mousse um, to the Shea Moisture's mousse. Alrighty, you guys, I am back. And as you can see, I've already defined my sides and my back. I'll link a video down below if you wanna see how I do this. So looking at it, everything looks pretty much identical. Um, I'm just going to apply some coconut oil on my fingers before I start unraveling these twists. And um, yeah, so I don't see any changes as far as in length of the hair with the two products. They pretty much seem pretty identical. So I'm gonna continue to just unravel these twists. And filling the twists, they both feel identical. There's no difference in the feel of my hair on either side. So yeah, I'm gonna continue to take it down to see how both products do um, when I separate the hair. So just watch and see how I do this. As far as um, moisture, my hair doesn't feel dry on either side, um, but it doesn't feel like greasy either. It feels nice and soft. Um, it looks like it's moisturized, so they don't look dry at all. Um, I'm getting pretty much the same results as I unravel these twists. Pretty much a little bit of frizz here and there, the same type of curl pattern. Everything pretty much seems identical. As far as hold, both products feel the same. Um, I don't feel any crunch. There's no flakes. Um, none of my um, twists are hard. Everything is just soft and fluffy and um, looks very moisturized. So all in all, you guys, I would say that both products provided me with shine, definition, moisture, soft curls, minimum frizz, as you can see. Um, the only thing that I would say is that the Shea Moisture is much more expensive by like $6, um, but they both have the same amount of product in the bottle. Um, also, the Lotta Body was a much thicker product, so you didn't have to use much. So I would say that the Lotta Body product would probably last you longer. So I have nothing bad to say about these products. There's no flaking, which I love. There's no hard curls, which I love. So yeah, I would suggest both of these products to you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about it in the comment section below. Of course, I will have all of the products used in this video down in the description box with a link if you're interested and I will talk to you guys on my next video bye I got bribes in the London just to be in the family pretty cards in the scammers getting the licks in the family legacy family ain't sitting like a family going out like a Montana I got bribes in the London London